Welcome to How I Got 99 Woodcutting. This is part of my How I Got 99 series. Originally, I wasn't going to start making guides, but I know there's different methods of doing things, and there'll always be someone saying that the guide is wrong. To avoid people getting mad about guides, I'm showing how I got level 99 in skills so people can reference it if they want to. Again, this isn't a guide, but this is how I got 99 Woodcutting. Before I show how I got level 99 woodcutting, if you are new here, consider hitting that like and subscribe button. It helps me out a ton. Thank you so much. What I will be covering in this video is the unwritten redwood rule and how I leveled. Starting off with the unwritten redwood rule. When going to the woodcutting guild, there's two redwood trees. On one tree, there are six places to cut the tree. This rule goes like two players per tree. On this graphic here, you can see player 1 gets one side and player 2 gets the other. When it comes to the spots in the middle, both player 1 and player 2 get one, giving both players 3 places to cut the tree. This rule is enforced to give both players a chance to AFK in peace and prevent crashing in worlds. Very simple concept. So next time when someone's crashing your redwood trees, refer them to this video and I'll explain for them. Now this is the process on how I train 99 woodcutting. My favorite place to start woodcutting would be Drainer Village next to the jail. Starting off for levels 1 to 15, you will need to cut down approximately 97 regular logs, which shouldn't take long. Staying in Drainer Village, moving closer to the bank, you will need to cut down 534 oak logs for 15 to 35. The reason why I did this to 35 is because it was a solid money maker at the start of my account. With current prices, each oak log is worth 71 GP each, so you should profit around 40,000 GP. You can do this method longer if you wish. For levels 35 to 50, we will be moving east of Drainer to the start of the Sheep Shearer quest near the pond. We will be cutting willow logs now. Willow logs are not worth very much, so we will be cutting and dropping these. You will need to cut 1,170 willow logs to get to level 50. For levels 50 to 90, I cut teak trees at Fossil Island. You will need to plant these teak trees at the hardwood patch and you'll need 35 farming to do that. If you don't know how to train farming and you need something to reference, look at the top right for my How I Got 99 farming video. The great thing about Fossil Island is that these patches will grow back like normal trees. Another great thing is that you're able to 1.5 tick these for faster experience. On screen now is me attempting to do the 1.5 teak method. I say attempting because I have not done this method in many months. You do not need to do this tick method if you don't want to. You can AFK these but overall you will need to cut 61,706 teak logs. I would also recommend getting the infernal dragon axe at level 61 if you have 85 fire making. Again, if you need a video to reference on how to train fire making, look at the icon in the top right to see my video on how I got 99 fire making. For levels 90 to 99, I cut redwood trees at the woodcutting guild. Redwood trees are a great way to AFK and gain XP. I guess that's why they call them burnt trees. All jokes aside, you will need to cut 20,232 redwood logs. Redwood trees also give a great chance to get in the woodcutting pet, the beaver, which I got at level 90. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you are new here and you haven't seen my other videos, check out the playlist on the left and might as well check out some of the interviews I've done with some of your favorite content creators. Anyways, my name is Snack Food, and I'll see you later. Peace.